Hi, this is Joachim for statisticsglobe.com and in this video I will show you how to convert the characters in a data frame to uppercase. So in the video I'm going to show you an example and this example is based on the data frame that we can create with lines 2 to 5 of the code. So if you run these lines of code you will see that at the top right of RStudio a new data frame object appears. And we can also have a look at this data frame object by clicking on the data object and then you can see that a new window appears which is showing our data. And as you can see our data consists of five rows and three columns whereby the columns x1 and x3 contain character strings. Now let's assume that we want to convert all of these characters to uppercase. Then we can apply the code that you can see in line 7 to 15. So in these lines of code I'm using a combination of the data frame function, the lapply function and the isCharacter function and then finally I'm also using the toUpper function which is converting our characters to uppercase. Now this code might look a little bit complicated, however I will put the whole code that I'm showing here into the description of the video so you can check it out there. And for your own data you simply need to replace the data frame name that you can see here. So in our case we have called our data frame data. So you just need to replace this data frame name with the data frame name of your own data. Now if we run these lines of code all together then you can see that a new data frame object appears at the top right of RStudio which is called data new. And again we can have a look at this data frame object by clicking on the data object and then a new window appears and now you can see that all the characters in our data frame are converted to uppercase. So in this video you have learned how to convert characters in a data frame to uppercase with the R programming language. However, in case you want to learn more on this topic, you could check out my homepage statisticsglobe.com because on the homepage I have recently published a tutorial in which I'm explaining the R programming codes of this video in some more detail and I will put a link to this tutorial into the description of the video so you can check it out there. And furthermore, if you have liked the video, I would be very happy if you give me thumbs up on the video or if you leave me some positive feedback in the comments. And make sure to subscribe to my YouTube channel in order to get notifications in future when I'm releasing new videos to the channel. That's it for this video. Thanks a lot. See you next time.